when you are totally in love, when you walk into the room with your spouse that you truly love, you don't have to say a word. Just their presence in that room, you know everything is going to be all right. You know no matter what you went through that day, and you don't matter how much your boss yelled or screamed at you, but if you can get home to the one that you truly love, when you walk into that room, it seems like no matter what, they can just look at you, wink at you, smile at you, and never say a word for an hour, but you know everything is going to be all right. Honey, when you are in the presence of God, you don't have to say nothing. You don't have to talk about anything just to be in his presence, just to know that he is in your room you know everything is gonna be okay do I got anybody in here that knows everything is gonna be okay you ain't felt the presence of God in so long you don't know what to do but if I was you I get to my feet and give God some praise for what he's about to do in my life I would give God some love I said I would give God some love I would give God some love if I was you I would try God if I was you I would try God the tunes of your mind haunt us why can't we get still why do we always got to move around why is nothing satisfying in us in life why I take one step forward and run right back to the grave honey you are going back to the death that you came out of until you close that tomb in your mind you can never get nowhere with Jesus Christ honey your mind is your tomb we walk down the lonely hallways of our mind misery enjoys company As I began to dig deeper, I found out that in your mind, you and your thoughts are the greatest preacher you will ever hear is yourself. I said the greatest preacher that you'll ever hear is yourself. For you listen to your voice more than any other person. And what your tomb of your life says that you will have is what you are going to have. And what the tombs of your life says you're going to succeed is what you are going to succeed. But my tombs has been closed off. And my thinking has been changed. Because I know because of the blood of Jesus Christ, I can have all things through Jesus Christ who strengthens me. I am more than a conqueror. Ain't no weapon formed against me shall prosper, for I am more. Honey, and I say it, it said, he bore my sicknesses, he bore my disease, he bore my sin, he bore my transgressions. Honey, I don't have to go back to the tomb of death no more. Honey, I don't have to. When I set this snare in a path that's beaten down, wore out, got grooves in it you see a deer can make a path but a raccoon will use a path that a deer made you see the deer made the path the deer made the breaking the deer made the rut but the raccoon takes advantage of it whose path are you following that ain't your path it's about time that we get out the snares of other people's lives and begin to make our own path at God where there ain't no snare I don't need your trouble I don't need your pain I don't need your aggravation I don't need to be caught in your snare I'll make my own path I'll go my own road I'll go with Jesus Christ all day long for he's my savior he's my my rock he's my fortress he's my cool drink of water on a hot day he's my majesty he's a king of kings and the lord of lords i don't need nobody have you ever stood up in the morning washed your eyes out combed your hair looked at yourself in the mirror and said the day i'm going to do this on my own the day i'm going to come out of this thing but you got a problem once you get caught in a snare mikey you can't get out of it you can't get out of it on your own you can't reach across your back and pull that snare off your life because that snare is locked in your life you are set to do until jesus shows up and all you need is a touch 
comes from Jesus and when Jesus shows up the snare becomes free in your life when the greatest of all great show up in your life that addiction's gotta go that anxiety's gotta go that death has gotta go I am no longer bound but I am free is anybody in here this morning free free from my past free from my sorrows free from my loneliness free from my stress free 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 is anybody free somebody give God a shout on my snare honey the moment you accepted Jesus Christ as your Lord and Savior, the stopper went on every snare. Now quit fighting the snare and just wait on Jesus for that one touch. I said quit fighting the snare and wait on Jesus for that one touch. He is on the way. He's getting out of his, oh my God, he's getting out of heaven. He's coming down upon the earth and he's coming after you and me. Honey, he is on the way. Somebody say Jesus is on the way say snare you have no control over my life today the stopper the blood of Jesus Christ shall keep me alive and Jesus is coming to set me free give God some praise in here Give me some praise in here. If you're in this room and you don't know Jesus Christ as your Lord and Savior, as the best step that you can ever make, that puts the stopper on your snare of life. Every one of us in this room has a snare. Everyone, there ain't one in here that don't. I, I, I want to I leave with that. There ain't nobody in here holier than nobody else. You can drink all the holy water, sprinkle it all you want, eat all everything that's clean, all you want to clean. I don't care what you do. You are no holier than the other person. Everybody has a snare. No matter how size or how big, everybody's got a snare. And honey, I ask you this morning to turn that snare over to Jesus Christ. And if you're in this room and you don't know Jesus as your personal Savior, all you got to say is, Jesus, I repent. Say, Jesus, I repent. You just added the blood of Jesus Christ to your life. Can somebody say?